So the craziest thing is my self-centered ass was at the doctor getting my um, pre-op appointment. I was getting my boobs redone because it's just a fucking mess under here. So I was going to get these sisters fixed like at the consultation about to pay and everything. And he said, okay, everything looks great. Your blood work came back perfect, but the pregnancy test came back indiscriminate. I'm like, what does that mean? And he says, um, oh, it's don't, no big deal, don't worry about it. It just happens sometimes the machine just reads it wrong. Just go back to the lab and get another test. And I said, okay, cool. So on the way to my hair appointment, I stopped by the drugstore, get a pregnancy test, go to my hair appointment, and I'm in the bathroom just doing this just for and giggles because I know it's gonna say negative, peeing on a stick, and I'm about to go back into, you know, get my hair done, and I look down, I'm like, Jesus. Uh, and I just kind of stayed in the bathroom for a second and I just was, I remember just staring and just staring at it. And I, I was oddly calm because I felt like where in the place that I was, I wasn't able to react and maybe that helped me. Um, so I just kind of gathered my pearls and went and sat in the salon chair. So not only did I just find out I'm pregnant, but I'm pregnant um, by Fetty Wap. And um, I can't get my boobs done anymore. <laughs> And Fetty had left, he went to New Jersey. I called him, his phone was going to voicemail, he was still on the plane. So I texted him and said, call me as soon as you land. And Fetty called me back, got on the phone in my car, talked to him and his response was not what I wanted to hear. So once that happened, I think um, Fetty's response or his team's response just started a whole Twitter battle and just an unnecessary beef. Um, I tried my best to stay positive, but you know, I got a little petty Freddy. I got a little uh, Twitter thumbs here and there, but we're beyond that, and here we are, what a beautiful child, so. <laughs>